हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट स्पूलिंग द नेक्स्ट प्रॉपर्टी दैट वी आर लर्निंग हियर इज स्पूलिंग ओके एंड स्पूलिंग इज एन एक्रोनिम स्पूलिंग स्टैंड फॉर साइमल्टेनियस peripheral operation online okay now the term uh, simultaneous peripheral uh, is is an uh, is is for io devices and we want an io devices online here online means here is a, is a cpu is busy with execution okay now the idea of spooling is somewhat related uh, with the batch system only and the problem that we have solved for the batch system was uh, we it was solved by very early a forerunner of this operating system call monitor and what monitor has done is that it has group uh, similar kind of job that required similar kind of command the so similar kind of job and that required similar kind of command okay so now here a uh, the the so uh, the why it was required the reason was that um, that it takes lot of time you know to load it and then finally execute it so just group together and uh, just just to uh, remove this human intervention in middle okay so just want to take down setup time and take down time we want to minimize setup time and take down time take down time we want to minimize okay so now here uh, in this case uh, what we are having is uh, is mechanical devices this card reader is 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 a mechanical device previously i'm talking about uh, earlier mechanical and this printer was also a a mechanical device okay so both are both uh, both are mechanical device ab now the the main issue here in this case is that uh, speed of cpu and speed of this uh, device which is a card reader and the printer now earlier this and now also uh, that the speed there is a mismatch the speed at which cpu works at that speed at which card reader and printer the mechanical devices works so lot of time you know lot lot of cpu time is spent on a uh, lot of cpu time spent on this is reading the card or or putting the output because they are inherently uh, slower devices card reader and printers are slower devices so just think over a situation where we have a cpu and it is printing and uh, the way the way the printer works and engaging the cpu all the time it's not at all a good idea okay uh, for utilization cpu utilization Okay. so what to do what to do here in this case so they come up with a very different idea and that idea is nothing but buffering so the idea of the buffer buffering is that uh, they allocated some space in memory or hard disk memory or hard disk right and they the, this space works as a buffer so data the card reader data directly uh, goes from card reader to disk or buffer at whatever the speed you know this can uh, uh, we can have read the card reader and then finally the data goes from uh, let's say if if you want to output from the disk to memory and memory to the printer okay at that time we can simply you know cpu can be busy 
with its own task okay so that 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 thing is basically called the calls uh, that that thing we are calling it as uh, spooling simultaneous so cpu is busy with its own task and simultaneously it is reading into the buffer and from the disk it is writing into the buffer so simultaneously peripheral operation on line means cpu and peripheral device can act simultaneously so that is the point here in this case and that summarized in this way that peripheral devices have always been slower than the core processing units this is a severe problem in case of early mainframes for example a job which read the punch card or generate the printed output directly is forced to run at the speed of slow mechanical devices okay so that to avoid this thing we come up with a buffer that is in the disk or the memory so that data can be directly read from the card reader to disk or buffer at their own pace and cpu will be engaged with its own activity so few more points here spooling is an acronym of simultaneous peripheral operation online spooling refers to putting the data of various io job into a buffer that buffer uh, this buffer is a special area in the memory or hard disk which is accessible to the io devices now handling io device data spooling as devices have the different data access rates maintain the spooling buffer which provide waiting station for the data where data can rest while the slower device can catch up maintains parallel computation okay simultaneous computation because spooling process as a computer can perform io in parallel fashion okay so it be it becomes possible to have a computer read data from a tape and write a data to the disk and write out to a tape or a printer while doing the computing the task okay so this operation happens simultaneously and that is something called as spooling 